Hey y'all and good morning. How is everyone today? Hope y'all are doing great. I am about to leave to go and get my driver's license renewed. So I'm gonna have a picture taken. And the thing about having your picture taken, I'm gonna talk about it in hot chocolate chat, but just a quick synopsis, a quick glimpse into what I'm about to talk about on hot chocolate chat that I'll post in here in this video is how do you smile? Do you, I don't know. Yeah, smiling and the, the cause it's like it stays. It stays with you and you can't just, hey, can we do a redo? You know what I'm saying? Can I, can I check that? Can we Photoshop that a little bit? You know, you just can't do that. So anyway, let me show you what I'm wearing today. So today we have on this kind of beachy shirt. I actually bought it because one of our daughters was getting married on a beach and I thought it would be a great outfit to have on hand. I had white pants that go with it, but they're in storage. I haven't got them out of storage yet. Here's the problem with the shirt though. It's that gauzy material, which is fantastic. It's breathable, it's great, but like also, like if I don't, I mean, I'm not, that's pushing my stomach out, but I'm just saying. Also, like it retains like, so like, can y'all see? I don't know. I'll just have to remember to like suck it in the whole day and you know, but it's, it's a nice length. I like the shirt a lot. I just paired it with jeans and of course some flip flops. I say like wearing flip flops, like that's a thing. I don't, I don't wear flip flops every day. I would just wear flats every day. Do I wear flip flops, sandals? I don't know. I, I would just say I'm, um, I wear flats every day. I do have a realtor friend that does wear flip flops. It's kind of her thing, like her signature. She always wears flip flops. But um, dreaming about that beach life, I don't know. But I like the top, I like the color, and so I chose this color because I thought, you know, hey, for my permanent driver's license photo, which I couldn't even tell you what I wore in my last photo, I guess I need to go look at it, but um, watch me more than the same thing, that'd be funny. No, I know for sure I didn't. But I got this at Cracker Barrel, y'all. Like, you should shop the store at Cracker Barrel. Sometimes they have some cute stuff on clearance, too. This wasn't on clearance, but sometimes they have a lot of cute stuff on clearance. But now I need to get headed out the door because I need to do that and I have to do the sponsored post. There's my chair in the corner. I still need that lamp to go over there. Kinda cuting that spot up. And I need art. Y'all, I need, I need art in the house. It just feels like that kind of feeling. But I am going to go. I feel like I'm already rambling and I just barely started this vlog. I need to go because I'm going to go get my driver's license renewed. Then I need to <clears throat> come home and plan out the post for Rubbermaid because I'm doing that sponsored post for them. <laughs> and I'm so excited because y'all, I told you this yesterday. I know I did, but it has the spaghetti container. That's the container I wanted. So I'm super excited about that. So let's get the day going because the day ain't gonna get getting unless we get going. You know what I'm saying? All right. Hi, Captain. What'd you have to say? Huh? What'd you have to say to the fine folks watching our Grey House vlogs, huh? I'm at the DPS office now and I'm trying to practice some smile. No, that's not what I'm going to do. I don't know. Um, kids are here getting their driver's license. I hope there's not too long of a wait. There normally is. Making a super quick trip to Costco because I know if I wait until this weekend, it's going to be crazy, crazy busy. So I'm going to go get all my stuff now. I don't have that much to get, but I have a few things. Done shopping at Costco and I did get myself some more because I'm just in love with like little slippers, um, like slipper socks. And I got paper towels, I got quiche, I got dumplings, I got fried rice and water and paper towels. And I got a pair of shorts for myself. <laughs> but um, I also ran into a client that's been avoiding me. So that was like, hi, I see you. And 
so. But it's okay. All I said was like, hey, it's great to see you. And then he left quickly. So I was like, bye. <laughs> Answer my text. <laughs> no, it's okay. Uh, I know sometimes like telling people stuff is hard, but I'm just like, hey, just, I don't want to bug people either, you know? All right, so I'm going to show them my receipt and get headed out and get the cold stuff back home. Hey, y'all, I finally made it home. The traffic down 30 and then down 80 was ridiculous, but I got this black and white checked blousey top that ties in the front. And then I got a black pair of shorts, which I don't have any black shorts, so it wasn't a double purchase. And then I got some more, because I'm obsessed with them, I got some more cozy um, slipper socks and a lounge. It even says lounge set on the packaging, because I, I love to lounge. I also bought Food Wise in an unfortunate turn of events. <laughs> I bought butter. And that was not the unfortunate part, but. But as you can see, I have butter, but I already had butter, a whole thing of it unopened. I also got these dumplings. I got this crustless quiche for Marvin and this Japanese style fried rice. I say for Marvin because he primarily takes that to work for his lunch, but I mean, I can eat it too. And then I also got paper towels. And picante sauce, what? Yes, I sure did. Got picante sauce. And I was gonna go to work, but it's now 1.30, because it took me five ever, not four ever, it was longer than four ever, it was five ever for me to get out of the DMV, to get to Costco, and then to come back, because traffic was stupid. I had to exit and go the back way, and that was stupid, because everybody else was doing it too. So, finally home. I need to do this shoot for Rubbermaid really quick. Not really quick, but I need to do it before it gets too much darker because I don't want to add light to the house. I'd just rather use natural light. And yeah, so that's what I'm gonna do right now. Just prep for that, style the shoot really quick and see what I can come up with and hope they like it. And then Marvin will be home. Marvin should be getting off in about 30 minutes or so. I'm gonna call him and see, make sure he's getting off because then I, if for sure I'll stay home. But it was a good day. I got some things done that I needed to get done, so thumbs up for that. Now I'm gonna go get the picante sauce out. If there's anything else in my car that needs to come out, I'm gonna start straightening up my house and set up the shoot. Hey babe, wave it. Wave at our Gray Bay fans. <laughs> okay, so I've set up the ring light in here to get ready to take some shots of the inside of our pantry for that Rubbermaid sponsored post that I'm doing. So it looks fine to me, but I have so much empty space, which seems kind of wasteful, but I suppose if we were a family of more than two folks, we'd need the space. But with the Rubbermaid stuff, I'm also able to kind of compact some stuff down too. So I like how it looks. I'm gonna take a couple photos and send my stuff over to the gal and hopefully she'll like it too. So here's how, see the ring light, just wow. Hey y'all and welcome to Hot Chocolate Chat. Today I'm drinking a hot chocolate. It is literally, there ain't nothing in it. Well, that's kind of depressing, but I think I've got hot chocolate left. No, you don't. It was a hot chocolate from Starbucks, but it's empty now, so. I'll rinse it out and recycle it. So I got up this morning and I got up at a decent time. I headed out to the DMV and then waited about two hours to get my license renewed. But I want to know, how do you smile for your DMV picture? And I just looked up to see if there were any type of tutorials online and there are. Anyway, so how did you smile for your DMV photo? Because I didn't. Also, I'm secretly thinking that I need to film a video titled DMV Photo Tips by 51 year old mom, because I'm not 52 yet. So I toyed around with like having my hair like this, my hair behind me, 
my hair like to one side. Should I curl it? No, I ain't that fancy. Or like, you know, just what should I do with my hair? So I just wore it normal like I always do. And I pretty much did my makeup regular as you can tell. And so like, I mean, you know, but there were a ton of makeup tutorials for like getting, like getting your DMV photo taken. So I'm like, maybe I should have taken more time. And then there was the whole, should I like, you know, like, I mean, how should I pose? Of course, there are only so many different ways. Like I couldn't go like, like that, although I wanted to. So that, that's what I'm working with. Let me, let me try to recreate. <sighs> what, was there a Snapchat filter on that camera lady? <laughs> she said I looked cute though, and like, why wouldn't I believe you? I mean, why wouldn't I? So I'm gonna have to live with that photo for six more years, till 2025. Y'all leave me a comment. Let me know if you're in the same boat as I am. And if your photo's just kinda like, meh. I mean, it could've been worse. Trust me, it could've been worse. Leave me a comment, message me back, tag me in a post, you know, do all, do all the things. And if you wanna follow me on Snapchat, it's Side of Awesome. And on Instagram and YouTube, it's Our Gray House. But just don't follow me in real life though, because that's creepy. And I hesitated because like the last couple times I've been saying, and on Words with Friends 2 and Pokemon Go, I'm out of Grey House. And I didn't do it that this time. But if you want to follow me there too, it's fine. Because I definitely need more Words with Friends 2 games. Because I'm losing them all, but I'm still, I have fun playing. It is time to go to bed. I have a showing in the morning at nine. And then I need to run and get Hattie something for her birthday. And then, Oh, it's a cat texting me back. And then I have Ellie's birthday, no, Hattie's birthday party. I'm going to get Hattie's present. I have Hattie's birthday party at 11. So it is 10.36. I need to go to bed. Otherwise, I won't want to get up. I won't want to get ready. And the house that I'm going to is like 20 minutes away. So, yeah, I need to get ready for bed. But, thank you guys so much for watching. I just found out my grand, one of my granddaughters, little granddaughter, is watching. So, Sophia, if you're watching, hey girly, love you. Thanks for following our gray house. I love you so much. And anyway, we FaceTimed the kiddos shine. It was a lot of fun. But, I'm going to go to bed. I'll see you guys tomorrow because we've got a day planned tomorrow. Wow, that's, maybe keep the hair like this. Anyways, uh, don't forget to be kind to others, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'll see you guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.